Hello friends today i am going to tell you another story and the title of the story is Salim and the beggar Long time ago in a village there was a fisherman used to live named Salim Every morning he used to go to the river for fishing and he sells those fishes in the evening to run his family One day he was coming back to his home in the evening Suddenly he met with a beggar the beggar asked him Sir please give me some money I have not had anything for past few days Salim had a big heart and could not see anyone in trouble so he took out some money from his pocket and gave it to him Take it my brother and eat something out of these rupees Thank you so much sir Next day When Salim was coming back from the market he met the beggar again Sir please give some money to eat He again offered him some money to eat It goes on for few days Every evening that beggar met Salim and Salim used to give him some money for the food One day when Salim was coming back from the market at the evening time again he met that beggar Sir I am very hungry please give some money to eat as every day Salim gave him some money for food and he went off and while walking for a few yards he thought every day I give him some money for the food but still his condition has not gone better I think I should give him some more money thinking this he went back to him and said Uh listen brother tomorrow you come at the river bank i want to give you something very big definitely sir i will definitely come to the river bank tomorrow next day when salim reached at the river bank he saw that the beggar was already waiting for him after seeing salim the beggar said sir i have reached Now give me which award you want to give me I will give you a great reward but for that you have to catch some fishes for me from the river The beggar got very disappointed after listening to Salim he could not understand anything but afterwards he agreed Okay all right I will catch some fishes for you Okay let's go Now you throw this net in the river and take out some fishes for me. The beggar threw the net in the river and in the same manner he placed it in the river. After seeing this, Salim asked him, "What are you doing? You only told me to uh, throw the net in the river. I told you to throw the net to catch the fishes. Not this way. I will teach you how to throw the net." to catch the fishes uh, look carefully after saying this salim took out the net from the water and threw it again in a right manner in the river but before that a fish could be trapped in it he quickly pulled up the trap back after seeing this the beggar asked salim oh what have you done why did you pull out the net according to my promise Today you will catch the fishes then only I will give you a big prize now in a right and correct manner throw a trap the beggar threw the net in the river but he could not do it properly he tried it for many times in the end he managed to throw it correctly now both of them were waiting to catch the fishes in their trap for a long time No fish was trapped in the net so being very hungry the beggar said in spite asking me to catch the fishes if if you could give me some money to eat so that could have been better i don't know why i am doing all this ah uh-uh, ah just relax to catch the fishes we have to be calm and collective after listening that the beggar stayed calm but he was hungry they both stayed like this for a long time in the end they could hear something in the net when they looked at the net 
so they saw lots of fishes were trapped in the net. Oh God, we have got some fishes! Uh, don't shout, just pull the net out. Wait, 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 wait. And then they both pulled the net out. They have got so many fishes in the net. After looking at it, the beggar was very happy and excited. He said to Salim, I have got some fishes for you. Now, according to your promise, you please give me a big award. After listening this, Salim replied very politely, You have got your award. When? You have not given me any award. Brother, I taught you that how to catch fishes. Now you need not to beg or ask for any award to anyone. Now you can trap fishes, sell them in the market and live a respectable life. The beggar understood Salim's lesson and replied to him. You are absolutely right. I have got my award. Now I can catch the fishes and sell them to spend my life respectfully. That's how the beggar stopped begging and spent his life by catching and selling fishes respectfully. So friends, the moral of the story is this, that anybody can change his fortune by his hard work. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share and comment. And to be the first person to watch our videos, make sure to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for timely notifications.